Hi guys! I'm finally back on YouTube, yeah! I wanted so bad to film a video, but during this month I had a lot of things to do that I will, that I will tell you about in this video. And this video will be uh, chatty, get ready with me. I want to say that if you hear thunders in the background, it's because the weather today is really awful. So, <laughs> sorry about that. I'm going to pin my hair and start the get ready with me. So... Let's start. I wanted to tell you that I bleached my hair. Ah, oh, purple! <laughs> I have purple hair now and I wanted them to be lilac, but uh, there was some issues with the lilac shades, so I bleached them purple and I love them, but I'm planning to bleach them in a lilac shade, like more pastel-y, but I love them right now. I mean, they suit my personality, my, my style. I'm starting to feel they need some air, like they need some uh, relaxed time because I'm stressing them so much. I mean, in the last year I went from blonde to gray to pink to purple and they're slowly dying. So I think that I found my shade, my color. Uh, purple is such a great such a great color I'm really vibing with it so for some time I think that I will leave them purple and <laughs> leave them alone like they're saying let me breathe girl start with this um, I always use this to start my makeup from Clinique this is the dramatic dramatically different oil control gel and I always start with this this is more for skincare than for makeup but it is like a barrier between my skin and all of the products that i'm going to apply as i told you in the beginning i wanted to come back on youtube but i couldn't find the time because i was really busy during this month i had to prepare for an important exam at university because right now it's exam season and I had to prepare for this exam. I've done my exam at the beginning of this week and I, it, it went really well. So all the effort and all the hard work really paid off. So now I have to study for another exam in July, but I want to organize my job better and I want to film some videos during this time. So I may not be consistent, but I want to film more. I'm going to apply this Elf Cookies and, Dream, Cookies and Dreams primer. This one, we tried this together on camera. I'm really loving this primer. Also during summer, my skin is really, really, really oily. It's always oily, but during summer it's extreme, so I need to apply very mattifying primers. I'm going to apply this foundation from Too Faced, the Born This Way Matte 24 Hours Foundation in the shade Pearl. This is like not full coverage, not... This is like medium coverage. This is what I like about this foundation, but at the same time, it lasts on your skin. I was saying this month has been quite stressful. And I mean, I had to deal with anxiety. I, I tend to be a perfectionist when it comes to exams and also on YouTube, everything has to be perfect for me. So it can be a burden sometimes because I'm like, always worrying about everything. Everything has to be smooth and perfect. But this time I managed to deal with my anxiety and with my perfectionism because mm, I'm learning to deal with it. It is kind of unrealistic to always accept like perfection to be there. You can't be always perfect because it is not real in, I mean, it is not how the real world works. So I'm learning to accept this and I'm benefiting from this because girl, I needed some. And the fact is when you're always trying to achieve perfection, you will 
almost every time ends up having some burnouts and things like that. So I said enough and I'm working to become a better person <laughs> to manage my, um, to manage this perfectionism. So now I'm going to use the Rare Beauty Concealer uh, in the shade 180W. This concealer, I like it because it's not like, I, I, in general, I, I haven't tried a lot of products from Rare Beauty, but the ones I've tried, I really like them because they're like, not full coverage, but it is more on the natural side and I'm liking this. After my exam, I'm taking a few days off and then I'm starting to study again because my next exam would be on ancient Rome history. So it's going to be a lot to study. Not a lot, but it's going to be stressful. <laughs> But I think that if you organize your work on time and I always have my to-do list, you can do it. There's nothing impossible for you. So uh, organization is always the key for me personally. Now I'm going to bake with the Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder from Maybelline in the shade 10. I also know what next video will be. I think that it will be a video haul because I'm buying a lot of things for summer. I'm really excited about summer. Uh, it's my favorite season of the year. And in Italy, it's already so hot. I mean, 35 degrees. I went to the beach twice, but one time I was lucky, but I only stayed there like for two hours. And the other time it was last Saturday, I finished studying. I studied everything and I wanted to go to the beach. I went there and it started raining. So I was like, am I a joke to you? I don't know. So now this weekend will also be rainy, but next week before starting to study, I want to go to the beach and I want to do some sunbathing because I'm pale AF and everyone else is already tanned. You can see I'm pale AF, so for me, it's really difficult to get tanned and not get burned. I really have to be cautious with sun. So I have 50, 50 plus uh, SPF uh, sunscreen. Now, um, I have to do brows, but I'm going to do them off camera because it takes me so long. <laughs> so I will come back to you guys to keep chatting and keep getting ready. <laughs> okay guys, I'm back. I've done my brows and I've also applied my primer. I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills eye primer. So I'm going to zoom you in and I'm going to do my eyes. I use this, the Muse palette by Vive. Uh, I'm, tr I'm using products that I have and I've already tried because I want to do makeup where I'm sure about the things that I'm doing. I'm not here to experiment today, I'm here to just get ready with the things that I use the most in the last few weeks. So I'm going to use this shade Peony, the first one to set my primer. Another thing that I want to talk about is when I was studying for my exam, like I always feel this FOMO, fear of missing out. I don't know why, but especially this time, uh, the 2nd of June is like a big, uh, it's the, the, we celebrate the Republic here in Italy. So everyone go out to party, but I had to be home to study. In the past, it was like intense. I felt like, oh my God, everyone is out and I'm, I'm not there. But especially after the pandemic, I kind of switched my mentality. I mean, it's not that important if I can go out and especially if I have something more important to do. I'm at home because I have to study, not because I don't want to go out. I'm going to take the shade Mer Merlot <laughs> and I'm going to apply it here. So I think that nowadays, like, fear of missing out really is a big thing 
and we feel like we need to be there to be present and we need to be with other people but it's not that important at the end of the day if you have other things to do think about yourself first what you're doing if it is important for your future it always has to come first so this is the mentality i have right now and i think that growing up uh, I changed my mentality because when I was a teenager I I was always thinking I have to go out I have to be there I need to, to see other people but right now I don't mind if I don't go out for like a Saturday night and yeah I like to go out but it's not that it's not the end of the world if I have other things to do taking the color uh, love this one right here and I'm going to blend the shade upwards I'm going to highlight the brow bones with the shade divine this one right here also tomorrow is a really important day if you're an army because tomorrow June 10th is BTS comeback day I'm really excited. I'll be editing this video. The music video will probably drop, so I will have to stop and I will have to to have a few heart attacks. <laughs> but yeah, also I pre-ordered the new album, so it will the the site it said that they will ship from uh, June 14th. So, I was saying in the beginning that I want to film a uh, um, a haul, a summer haul, but if the album will arrive uh, the same day that I'm filming, I will open it on camera and I'm really excited about that. This is a really big comeback for the boys, so I hope everything will be, will be smooth. The teaser was perfect, everything was perfect. I'm really curious about the song how will it be and if it would be in Korean or in English I don't know but I'm excited I can't wait and <laughs> the wait since they announced the comeback till now been so difficult to bear with I hate when companies announce the the comeback and then the comeback is after one month. They always do this thing. Also, if you're an army, try to guess who my bias is. I don't know if you can tell, but try to guess it. I'm going to set this concealer just because I don't want anything to crease. I'm taking the first shade, Merlot, and I'm, I'm going to apply it on the under eye. One thing that I've started to do is when I arrive at the end of the eye here, I like to go down there, but like outside of the eye. I don't know how to explain, but I really love it. Okay, so instead of applying eyeliner, I've seen this technique from uh, Jamie Genevieve's Instagram because she was using the eye wand that I've tried the first time on the video and then I've tried it again and I wasn't liking it. I saw this technique on her in Instagram and I wanted to give it a try and it was really pretty so I want to try it back on camera. So what she was doing, she applied the eye wand right here like that then with her finger she does this to create an eyeliner you see Ooh, so pretty this makeup is really easy but it's what i like to do on summer it's easy at the same time it's quite f like it's not the simplest makeup I want to apply a little bit of black eyeliner because I want to apply lashes later, so I need to. Okay, I ended up drawing a big line. Like, not so big, but... I can see myself not wearing eyeliner, like black eyeliner. I don't know why, but I'm so... 
I, I, I like black eyeliner so much that when I'm not wearing it, I can't even recognize myself. I want to apply mascara now because when I apply mascara and then I apply setting spray and mascara always, make, always makes me look like a panda, like... I don't like it, so I, uh, I do my eyes, I apply my eyeliner, then I apply uh, bronzer and highlighter, then I do setting spray, and then, uh, last but not least, I apply mascara and lashes. So now, I'm going to do the other eye of camera, and then I'm going to come back. Okay guys, I'm back and it started raining, so you may hear raining sound in the background, but... I finished my eyes and now I'm going to apply the butter bronzer from Physician Formula to bronze. This is like my way to go bronzer during uh, summertime. This makes you look like you got a little bit of tan. So I'm really liking this. I'm going to use this highlighter, the Dandelion Twinkle from Benefit. I like this highlighter so much. Another thing that I wanted to tell you is me and my friends are thinking about booking for a trip in September in Greece, like some island. I don't know where, maybe Zante. We, we call it Zante in Italian. I don't know how it is called, but Zante or Santorini. But we really want to go on a trip. Originally, we wanted to go to Spain, like Barcelona or things like that. Um, but Greece is less expensive than um, Spain because we want to go there in September when the season is kind of over. So people are starting to go away. <laughs> And we're thinking about that. So if you've been to any uh, Greek island and you suggest them, leave a comment down below and tell me about it. Now I'm going to use the Rare Beauty highlighter, the liquid highlighter, liquid luminizer in the shade Enlightenment. And I think I've already talked to you about this highlighter, this liquid highlighter, but I'm obsessed. Especially during summer, I think this is a must because it gives your skin like a shiny glow. This is one of the few highlighters that doesn't make my makeup smudge because as always having oily skin and applying liquid highlighters can be challenging sometimes. Now I'm applying my setting spray I have a little fan, but I need to recharge it. <laughs> uh, now I'm applying the mascara and I like this combination so much lately. This is the Sky High Mascara, really famous by Maybelline. And this is the Colossal Curl Bounce, also by Maybelline. I like this combination so much. And I'm going to apply it. For lips, I'm just going to apply this lipstick from Charlotte Tilbury, the Pillow Talk, and I just want to go easy with it. I don't know if I want to apply lashes because I really like this, like it's natural. During daytime, I don't tend to apply lashes. When I have to go out or I'm filming a video and it's like a full face of makeup, I like to apply lashes, but when it's daytime, I don't tend to use lashes, so I think that I'm going to leave them right like that. I'm just going to twirl them. I like it. So, the makeup is done. Let me fix my hair and I'll be back. Guys, so I'm back. I fixed my hair, I put my rings on and I'm here to tell you that we reached the end of today's video. Hope you liked it. Hope you had a fun time watching me getting ready and just 
Talking about so many things, let me know what you think about all the things we've talked about together. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and comment down below. <laughs> and don't forget to follow me on Instagram, link down below. Stay tuned, see you next week with probably a video haul. Bye!